Let's get back to what Spider-Man doing in the blood hunt. So as everybody's still getting attacked by vampires, Spider-Man out here fighting the lizard. This motherfucker like, Spider-Man smacked the shit out of his ass. He tried to jump him in the air, but the lizard grabbed us by his leg, smacked the shit out of his ass on the ground. He tried to stump him, but Spider-Man spider sense went off. He got out the way. Then he stopped charging at him because he working with Misty Knight. She come to ask him for some help, but he was like, nah, I'm too damn busy. I'm out here saving people. She was like, look, you're going to need to help me because I'm trying to find a cure. So they walked up out the alley and then they started helping all the rest of the people. So Spider-Man started to ask questions after fucking getting them under control and shit. But she wasn't telling them everything that was going on. The only thing she said is that it was being created by Morbius, but he got kidnapped along with Col uh, Colleen. And right now they're on this building. There are 83 floors up. So Spider-Man went to go check first to see if uh, they was really up there. He get up there and there ain't nobody there. So he comes back to them and let them know that there ain't nobody there. And he's guessing that this is a big ass distraction. So they was thinking like maybe the damn lizard got a way to find him. As his ass takes off. So Spider-Man and Misty chase him right all the way over to here. It's like an old church. They get up in there and he was like, come. They was like, damn, he's talking. And if y'all didn't know, he's no longer connected to the scientist, dude. He's his own person. So they find this underground lab. It's a lab belonging to the Beyond facility. Monica Rambeau, who was Captain uh, Marvel at the time, went, uh, went to war with them back in issue uh, 92 of this shit. While Misty Knight was trying to figure out where Morbius and them at through the uh, stuff, this motherfucking lizard went off to his own self to the door. All these damn vampires popped out, so they started to fight these motherfuckers. After they whooped their ass and put them out the door, Spider-Man uh, webbed the damn door up. Misty come out, I was like, come on. So they go to the tunnels and then they leave and then they go over to this church right here to meet up with this pastor. A vampire comes in, right? His ass instantly turned on fire because it's sacred ground. They came over there to get all their weapons and stuff blessed. He said, I'll help him, but he ain't doing the guns. So uh, Spider-Man give him his, uh, his web cartridges and he leaves because something been bothering him. Misty Knight ain't been telling him everything. So he goes back to that uh, place where the Beyond place had and start doing his own research. And he finds this girl named Maxine Danger. He don't know what the fuck she got to do with vampires. Maybe Misty will show him another card. He got it. At least it seems like people have gotten the message to it. Then he goes out right and he's like, damn, that's not good. As we see at they asked and got surrounded by all these vampires. And it's going to be continued. But we got to go see what Colleen and uh, Morbius up to, right? They locked up. Colleen get they self a bother there with this hairpin she had on her damn uh, wrist. As they waiting for the truck to hurry up and uh, stop. The truck go through this place, right? As soon as they open that motherfucker up, they get hit in the face by they ass. So they get to this door. She like, open the door. He's like, look, I'm strong, but this shit is beyond my capabilities. We got to go look for an elevator. So she asked Morbius, you got any idea who might be behind this? He said, none. I have no idea why you and Mr. Miss Knight uh, storm my underground laboratory either. So they get on the elevator. When they get out, it's a whole bunch of vampires, a corporation run by vampires. They get in there and get to whooping their ass, fucking their ass up, right? But after a while, they just stopped. So they was like, oh shit, here come the master. As Colleen, she got bit on the neck. And then we see the master, this dude right here. He said his, when he was alive, he went by TJ, a forgettable name for an insignificant man, a lackey for the Beyond Corporation. He is now Theatrice. Welcome to his stand-up, Hobgoblin, Inc. And you met him during Hollow's Eve uh, first little solo run. Morbius was like, quite the name. What exactly do you want from me? He was like, shit, I'm going to help you with your cure at once and for all. And all this going to be continued next month. And all this went down in that amazing Spider-Man blood hunt, issue one.